Hey guys, Adriana Pesciotti from Andrew Real Estate. Welcome to my newest club member listing, this amazing, and when I mean amazing, you will see what I mean, so stick with me. This amazing home, Porter Davis built, 40 square home, 560 square meters, backing onto the golf course, 192 Mandalay circuit. Like, share, and tag someone in this post that may be interested, because I promise it will not disappoint. Let's go through and check it out. So the first thing that you'll notice from street level is that it is an elevated facade. Uh, which makes the home feel more grand. And as you can see, it's got a beautiful mature garden uh, right in front. You've got a beautiful big double driveway with double remote car garage um, to head on in for two cars. And again, there's a lot of grandeur about this home. So let's go through and check it out. First thing you'll see, high ceilings and these beautiful big mesh doors. So these are secure doors, which you'll actually see throughout. Welcome home, guys. Hang on, I should have done this before. All right, so the first thing that you'll notice when you come in is this beautiful grand uh, central entrance hall, which is amazing, and these beautiful timber floors. Now they go throughout the majority of the living zone, which you will see as well. The first thing that, of course, as you come through, is got this beautiful master suite. So, one, two, three. Welcome inside, guys. And this is a master suite. Proper master. The owners have just put in new plush carpets. Beautiful soft carpets. And again, it's a massive, massive room. The one thing that you'll notice is these beautiful uh, timber blinds, as you can see here. Now, again, they are plantation shutters and they have proper plantation shutters. They open up beautifully. And again, it just gives that beautiful elegance. Again, the one thing that you see is these beautiful big windows. Let's loads of natural light through here as well, which is amazing. This is a nice queen size bed, but if you see the size of it, you can easily fit a, a super king in here. Coming through, now the house is fitted with central heating and cooling. It's refrigerated, it's zoned. So that is just, as you can see there, so it's a private system. Through here, you've got the beautiful big open ensuite, 20 mil stone, double vanity, big double shower with amazing rain head. I'll actually show you so you can see it. Nice big double shower, amazing big rain head, which I love. Nice niche in here as well. The toilet is actually just tucked around the corner, which is great. So you can do your business in private, so to speak. And then when you flip around, you've actually got a newly installed, I should say, walk-in. His and her walk-in robes have recently been put in with new carpets and the beautiful plantation shutters that actually face the streets to let all oh, the natural light in, which I think is amazing. So that's the master, guys. Just coming through, just look at the space in here. It's amazing. We're going to continue on through, guys. So this is a four-bedroom home, plus it has a dedicated study zone. So as you can see, the owners work from home and they definitely utilise this space as a study. Again, you don't have to be a study. It can be a multi-purpose space as well. Again, just tying in, they've got the beautiful... Uh, plantation shutters in here, which I think, again, are amazing. They add that beautiful, elegant look as well. So we're going to swivel around here. So there is a double garage through here, guys, as I mentioned. It's full of stuff, so we're not going to show that tonight, but you can see that through the opens. This is the first of its four living zones. That's right. Four bedrooms, four living zones. The old formal zone here doesn't get used, but again, perfect space for the kids, actually, I think, this one here. Or if you've got multiple people working from home, Office one, office two, which I think is amazing. Very big space, plantation shutters in here. Um, that is a little heater that the owners own, but you can always, might be able to throw that in the price. Um, so again, a really amazing two uh, living zones. Coming through guys, now this is what you're buying. Now there is a lot of special in here and I'm gonna start with a dining zone because you'll get what I mean. So dining zone here, the first thing that you'll notice in this space, and I don't know if you're going to be able to capture it from that angle just yet, the high ceilings. Big dining zone, central, plenty of space around, opens to your lounge zone, as you can see, nice big lounge room in here, and swivel around, <coughs> excuse me, <clears throat> bit of the sniffles, George, I just want you to pan back just quickly just to show this unique 
architectural pitched ceiling. And this actually goes upstairs to the loft. So bear with me because we're going to get up there soon. But again, just to show the space in this place. And again, very big lounge zone flows onto your beautiful kitchen here. This amazing oversized 40 mil stone with breakfast bar island bench, which again is amazing. There is a recessed sink. So you've got dual sink here, which is amazing. Nice tapware. And in this bench has plenty of storage space, a dishwasher. And on the other side, you've got more bench space. So 20 mil stone on this side. Nice big cooker. So Blanco cooker, as you can see there. Very nice. Glass flashback. You've got a walk-in pantry. I love this pantry because it does have a door on it. And it's a sliding door, which does give you the feel of space. Even just the little work, the bevel doors throughout, which are amazing. So again, nice big kitchen zone. Plumbed fridge space, as you can see. Plumbed. Let's continue on and see the other bedrooms. So through here, bedroom number two. And as you can see, it's a massive bedroom. So the bedrooms are all very good size. Big, big room, lateral light obviously coming through the windows. Now these are fitted with built-in robes and the owners have actually just gone and put these in. These are brand new, the doors that is. It had the old pull out, they've actually just put these in, which is great. So nice big mirrored robes. You've got the central bathroom, which I love and I actually just need to do this quickly. Sorry, I should have done this already. My bad. So, heat lamps, the first thing of course you'll notice is that amazing freestanding bath. Perfect to soak those tension days away. All kids, 20 mil stone, so stone in the bench tops as well in the bathrooms. Great size shower there as well. You've got the separate toilet over here, so you can do your business in private, which I think is amazing. And again, look at those beautiful uh, doors through here. This is another living zone, as you can see. Very good space. Again, it is very deceiving, this house, from the front. It just sort of keeps going and going. So this is a bit of a unique space because you don't really see it from the front. So again, this actually goes outside, which we'll show you around and we'll finish off at the end. So this goes outside onto the alfresco zone, which is amazing. Keep coming. Bear with me. Keep sticking with me. There's plenty to see. Bedroom number three. So this was the boys' room, the grandkids' room. Um, so the owners have grandkids and this is where they stay. So it's jazzed up as a boy room. So again, if you don't like the blue, you can always paint it. But again, I love it. It's got a nice boy warm feel to it as well, which I think is great. And we're in summer, so the aquatones in here are really, really awesome. But again, plantation shutters fitted throughout as well. And there's actually secure mesh, which you notice on all the windows as you walk through. And again, built-in robes. So again, the mirrored robes, these have been built, uh, put in brand new. We're gonna keep on going this way. Fourth bedroom down the back. Again, nice big bed just to show you the space that these rooms have. Very big bedroom. Not much more to see because they are sort of mirror image. So again, built-in robes through there. You've got the laundry straight through there. So George will show you that. Very big laundry. So the, the cupboards up top have just been put in brand new as well. Very nice space in here. So again, you've got all the plumbing ready to go. You've got obviously broom cupboard through here. And there's a bit of a walk-in broom cupboard, which I quite like, or linen. And this is the access to outside. So this actually takes you out the back center of the golf course. But we're gonna wait a little bit more because this is what I wanna show you. So this area, this loft area is actually very unique. I got told from the owners that only one of three designed Porter Davis homes like this ever built. I don't know how true to that is, but I'd take their word for it. And again, it's that beautiful, modern timber floor, uh, steel and glass balustrade, which is amazing. And come on up here, guys. So the first thing I just want to swivel around to show you is those beautiful views of the golf course. So as you can see there, you get beautiful views of the golf course, which is amazing. There's a nice little bar section just as you come up here, which I think is great. And this is the other living zone that, again, it is a multi-purpose zone. So the owners utilize this for the grandkids. 
So lots of the grandkids spend lots of time here. Obviously nice big billiard table. But again, this zone here is a very multi-purpose space. So this zone up here, just quickly, is separately um, zoned for heating and cooling. Pitched roof in here, which is amazing. The other thing what I really like about this zone is they've actually added the skylights in to let in more natural light, which is great. Plus, it has plenty of storage options. So more storage, which you can really never get enough storage space. And of course, I have to do that. And then you've got this other lounge room over here that again, perfect for the kids and the grandkids. Now, if you're wanting a five bedroom house for someone that's older, teenager, this room is huge. You could easily make this in to another bedroom because you've got natural light coming in from the skylight. You add a nice door here, sleeping quarters, entertaining quarters. Again, very multi-purpose space and you don't find homes like this. Again, it is so deceiving from the front that you would not even know that this space actually exists up here. Absolutely. Let's show the roof looking down. Now the owner, Pat, actually said that her grandkids do throw um, toys down <laughs> and hit the family as they go down. But again, like you don't get this. So this amazing, amazing. It's definitely a home that you need to come and check out and do a proper walkthrough. The video, I don't think we'll do it justice. So we're gonna go down now and I'm gonna finish off outside. There's a couple of key points that I wanna show you outside, which I think you'll really, really love. And again, as I said, bear with me because there is a lot to see. So you've got triple stacker sliding doors as well as mesh screen. So they're security, but also for the purpose uh, of not letting bugs in, especially on a nice summer's night, which tonight is. While George stretches his back because it's a very long tour. Um, you've got this, which I think is amazing. And you've got this huge covered alfresco zone. Now, one thing that I want to show you, and I've opened them up for the purpose of the video, but these are by folds. That's how they walk. So basically like you see inside, and these are aluminium. So they're perfect for weather and they close off this space. So it does leave a bit of an open space, but you've got this space that's fully, almost fully enclosed. And you can even go to the extent of enclosing this so you get a, another outdoor room. And again, it's very low maintenance. So you can track around on that side just to see one side of the house. You've got side gate access there, nice mature garden. And this is the raised garden zone, which I think is very amazing and just, to hear that it is so quiet here in this estate. It's amazing. That is the green, as you can see there. See the little flag that is floating around. So you get these beautiful golf course used with, which are amazing. There's one thing that I also want to show you. So if you're a golfer, generally you would uh, play golf here. Obviously it's a beautiful course. Um, the one thing that you can do living in a golf course estate is actually own a golf cart. Um, and the owners actually do. So, this is a little clubhouse that the owner built, and I'm gonna show you what he's actually done. Ta-da! Golf cart, space ready. So, you don't have to park it in the garage to take up room in the garage so you can fit your double car. He's actually created his own little shed. There's actually, and I have to quickly show you, sorry George. Now, the golf cart does not necessarily come with the deal. It can be worked as separate to the sale, but the owners are potentially happy to sell it. Power ready to go to charge your golf cart. So if you're wanting a battery operated golf cart, it's here, or you can have a petrol one. And I just want to show you this quickly. So you want to start your golf. Off you go. And straight out into the course. Bang, and off you go. So this is what the perfect Mandalay house is living in this estate that you get. The multiple bedrooms, the multiple living zones, with all the bells and whistles, including that amazing loft space upstairs, 
that amazing outdoor entertaining zone and that golf cart access straight out onto Club Mandalay's award-winning golf course. The home itself is only four years old. As I said initially, Porter Davis, 40 square home, perfect for small or large families. Um, so I hope you enjoyed the tour. Thank you very much for sticking through this tour because there was a lot to see. I hope it's impressed you enough to come and check it out. Um, if you like any further information about this home or any of our homes, please make sure that you follow us on our social channels, Facebook and Instagram, as well as subscribe to our YouTube channel at My Agent Real Estate or give me a call anytime. Uh, I'd love to meet you at one of the open homes, but my number is 0402 055437. Thanks guys for enjoying the tour and I look forward to seeing you at one of the open homes. I promise this home will not disappoint. Thank you.